Hey everyone, I wanted to give you a short encouragement from my home to yours. Today, looking at Psalm 101. Now, that's not one of the like world-renowned common ones for memorizing, but I think it actually might deserve a little more credit than it usually gets. It's written by David, and one of the early things he says is, I will walk in my house with integrity of heart. And that just sticks out to me. I love that statement. I love how it's, it's connected with very real life. And it's a question, especially like during this lockdown time, I mean, we're in our homes more often and, and sometimes it's easy to have some sort of persona or some way of how we look to the outside world when we're outside. But in your home, do you have that same type of in integrity? And, and maybe that's something to ask yourself. What has being home more often during lockdown shown you about your own character? But David says, in my home, I'm going to walk with integrity of heart, and I'm going to make sure I, I don't put worthless things in front of my eyes. And then he gets around to the people that are in his life. So it's not just the place where he is, and, and sometimes who he is when he's alone in his house, but also who is he when he's around people, what people does he have around him. And, and a lot of the rest of the psalm goes through, I'm not going to let people be a, an, a big impact on my life if they're people who are um, haughty, prideful, arrogant people who are are slanderers who, who just use their mouths to say all kind of bad things about other people. Those aren't going to be the people that I have around me. But he says, I'm going to, I'm going to have those that are the, the righteous, the upright will be the ones that minister to me. Will, will be like, will be my friends, will be the people who I get my advice from. That's, that's another question. Who do you get your opinions and input and advice from? Uh, consider that. So those are the two things to look at. Who are you in your own house? Do you walk with integrity? And, and who are the people that are feeding into you? Who are the ones that give you advice or, or help shape your idea of what life should be like? And hopefully you can say like David that you'll walk with integrity of heart and that you'll let the people who are those that are following God's path be the ones that are giving you your inputs.